Hey everyone, a little bit of a different intro to this video because everything you're going to see I actually recorded on Tuesday evening and here it is Wednesday morning and we actually did get the scan. So please ignore anything that says we're going to get the scan soon and uh, yeah, I'm going to be including more of the scan pictures with it so you can see better looks at the things um, like the Henshin device. Going to be seeing a little more things. Uh, yeah, that's the gear tingler and a bit more about the gears. Um, we got a better look at the scans uh, from the scans of the suits and we get a lot of stuff about their own sidearms but that is about it as far as the new details so please sit back enjoy all of the information for what we found out about zen kaiser and i'll see you in the rest of the video which starts right now zen kai hype hey everyone ranger liz here Huge, huge video for you on a beautiful Tuesday night, Tuesday before Christmas. Merry Christmas, Toku Nation. Merry Christmas, anybody who wanted some Sentai information, because this is where we are at right now. You are looking at Kikai Sentai Zenkaiser, and we have gotten some stuff over. You saw in that brief little intro, we got a leak, we got another one, we got Zenkaiser, and then we got the poster. Now, this came out, it was what, Sunday, and I didn't really give a whole video on this one. My life has just been really busy right now. But the big and uh, short of it, I, yeah, that makes sense, right? It's gonna debut on March 7th. We're gonna be getting more information around January 15th, I think somewhere in there. One human, four robots, confirmed. One human, four robots, Yes, it is a Sentai team. It's from different worlds. They're going to team up to save people. Uh, Zenkaiser's world is controlled by evil. He is the one standing up past Sentai. They're going to be combining past Sentai powers. I am freaking out because I want to know where all this is going to go. One of the other things they said, and I got to give a shout out to Matt Hunt. I was watching this. Uh, he was live streaming it. There are going to be parallel worlds this season. It doesn't say each world is a different Sentai. It just keeps saying parallel worlds and it's just going on about one human four robots so that's all good and well that was the big information i didn't make a video about it and then today whoo hold on to your socks kids hold on to your socks are you ready bam oh yeah yeah, guys, what you are looking at right now is some, uh, this is, I don't want to say, like, concept art. This is more of the actual, like, artwork and information and stuff that's sent out. These aren't the toys. These aren't, like, the toy scans, toy catalogs, anything like that that we're probably still going to be getting before January 1st. So, don't forget, if you guys haven't done already, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification. You guys know I'm going to be telling you when more Zinkaiser news happens. But this is what we got today. And so, thank you so much. This is Toku Linked at Linked. Toku posted all of this uh, at this point, um, you know, it was like 9 a.m. my time, 10 a.m. my time. This is literally the first time I've gotten a chance to record is 8.50 p.m. right now. So y'all know it's been a crazy day, but we've got to talk about all of this. Toku linked, translated it. We're going to get through it. Let's talk about this first one because I know you're you already you're looking at it. You're looking at it and you're like that. That, that mecha, that looks familiar. We talked about that. We talked about that. Let's look at first, though, Zen Kaiser. Zen Kaiser, remember, is the human. Goshika Kaito. That is going to be our main, main hero. I, I'm not sure, but the, not the red, the white. The white hero, the main leader. Doesn't matter. His name is Kaito. He's a young man who wants to be number one in any field. It doesn't matter what he goes from zero to one. He's, he's usually a happy goof, but if switch is activated, he becomes a quote hot headed fool. Hot headed fool. He considers everyone his friend and often invades personal spaces. But in any case, he rushes at everything with full power, full throttle. Oh, I wish you guys couldn't see. I had a really good punch, but you guys couldn't see it through the. That's fine. That's fine. So that is in. Kaiser, remember Zen Kaiser first, the, the guy we saw, the suit, everything, leader of the Zen Kaiser. Next one, though, guys, you, you're going to be looking at it, you're like, ah, Daiju Zen, Daiju Zen. Not quite Daiju Zen, though. Boy, oh boy, do they look a lot alike. This is going to be Zen Kai Joran. Joran is actually the oldest member of the team. He thinks of himself as a cool and reserved old man, but he's actually an annoyingly stubborn kikainoid. Kikainoid, uh, I don't want to say like humanoid, but Kikainoid, like they're mecha, um, that, well, that's what they are. They're Kikainoids. 
However, even though he is mechanical life form, he is bad at technology and is a muscle-brained power type. <laughs> however, however, he is a fierce friend and values his friendships and hits it off immediately with Kaito. Also, he loves parties and being the center of attention. I, he'd probably make a great YouTuber. I hope maybe, and this is just, oh, this is a random thought, but remember how with, uh, Kiro, not Kirozer, um, uh, whatever, th these, these, these guys, Ryu Sojer that I couldn't think of, I want every tweet to end with one of the Mashins, like everything ended with Tira, like with, uh, Gabby Tira, who I got, oh no, he isn't up here, I bought, yeah, there's a year off here in Kaido, anyway, I bought a Gabby Tira, uh, not Gabby Tira, oh my gosh, now I'm thinking of all the way back, it doesn't matter, I've screwed up the whole thing at this point. You guys know what I'm talking about? I'm gonna have, uh, um, Tiramigo. I'm gonna have a thing. It's His name's Tiramigo. I've completely gone off the rails. Anywho, let's move to this yellow guy right here. Much like Gao Ranger, we're having Zenkai Gaon. Gaon is a, quote, natural airhead. Yay! Uh, he is a natural airhead, Kikanoid, who is peaceful and considers humanity as just one among animal kind. Conversely, he doesn't get along with his own kind and is rather cold to other mechanical forms. His specialty is cooking. Aww. He is very diligent, preparing meals for Kaito. Could it perhaps? It's like feeding your pet. He is a my pace kind of character. So I'm digging that. Um, not getting along well with other ones, but like, oh, humans are just kind of another animal or whatever, and he may think of... Zenkaiser as a pet. Oh, that's going to be a really, really fun dynamic. Um, there's also some stuff. We're going to talk more about the suits and everything that you're seeing uh, a little bit more in a bit. Let's go ahead and move on to this one because now we've seen Zenkaiser, we've seen red, we've seen yellow. How about let's take a look at blue and pink. Let's go ahead and look at blue is Zenkai Rune. Rune is a serious quote, class president type of character he loves learning but hasn't had a chance to receive formal schooling and there's a lot he doesn't know so there's that's already fun he reminds me of i mean honestly i'm sorry i have a little girl who watched a lot of frozen reminds me of olaf you know like he loves learning doesn't really quite know what's going on in the world looking for samantha all the time i'm not sure that some of you got that there's a lot he's interested in and knowing and sometimes his questions will be annoying or dark unintentionally can't wait to see that annoying or dark i want to see the dark questions i just think they're fun when they get thrown in like that also he loves cleanliness and his specialty is cleaning <laughs> okay that's a fun specialty um he has a habit of falling in love with people no matter their race so that's nice i mean love is love is love is love right it's a good message i have no idea who he's gonna fall in love with but i think uh he's he's pretty cute because he's kind of like the big bulky blue guy you know and he's like whoo whoo reminds me of um go buster blue gork gorky banana or something like that whatever it was i give up ah. hey something like that let's look at this really awesome pink pink one right here her name is zenkai majin or majin Majin, like Magi, uh, Ma Maji Ranger. So Sentai Majin, Majin, she considers herself reserved and shy, but at times is actually quite brazen, which I like. She loves magic. You don't say, Maji Ranger. <laughs> oh, so she loves magic. The occult, really interesting looking, and non scientific things. Hail science! She becomes intensely obsessed with those things she loves and is basically an otaku, which completely, I'm like, okay, I'm in for this. Um, as a mechanical life form, she sees humanity as fantasy and is incredibly interested in it. I think that's hilarious. That you, me, you imagine, like, me going into a machine world, and I'm like, whoa, this is all fantasy, and this machine's in the human world, I'm like, what? They're like, you're so squishy! Why are you so squishy? I'm like, it's Christmas. <laughs> I ate a lot of cookies. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Anywho, I'll leave it to the, I'll go with the guy who cooks. Oh, yeah. Also, in contrast with Vroon, she's the type to never clean up. So there's going to be, obviously, there's your, your fun fun. So you got your serious one. You've got your magic one. You've got your cool older brother. You've, you're seeing the personalities already. But this. <laughs> 
let's find out a little bit um a little bit more about kaito's parents right i'm gonna i'm gonna talk about the bird i'm gonna talk about the bird it's fine however his parents uh they're professors who discovered the existence of parallel worlds and are currently missing no plot point main ranger has parent issues it's someone called chip lynn I mean, I'm sorry, because um, <laughs> it's universal. Everybody has daddy issues. Um, yeah, so uh, also he is going to be hanging out with his grandma who runs a sweet shop cafe called Colorful. I'm a sucker for sweet shops, cafes, kind of, you think back with like O's and Akiva. I'm thinking of like places with the coffee. Obviously, oh, Cafe Nasca from, from Build. All those, I, I'm really partial to those kind of vibes those kind of settings so that always just makes me um naturally happy you know sweet shop hey uh wizard can't remember what the name of that uh rolling van was that sold the plain sugar donuts but that place too okay okay sechan sechan c s e c c h a n a mechanical bird that was left to kaito by his parents however when the enemy invades, he starts talking. It. Okay, I'll be the first one to admit, when I first started watching Sentai, I first started watching Sentai, uh, Gokaiser, loved it. Navi kind of drove me around. It's like, it took it took a good second watch through before I was like, I get it. Because I'm one of those people, if you've only watched a handful of Sentai, sometimes that mechanical sidekick thing just, uh, you know, in your brain. By the end, I love it. I love Navi. If I had the money, I would have bought one of those Navi plushies a forever ago. But you know how much they sell for on Mandarake and the aftermarket now. Anywho, this little bird right here, Sechan, I can't wait to see a little more about him. Because I'm just, I'm kind of a, a sucker for him. Like with uh, Time Ranger and Go, I just, I want to see him. It oddly makes me want to watch Go Siger because that data status was so weird looking. I kind of want to watch him. Uh, what else did we learn? How about the animal vehicle form names for the Kikanoids? We have uh, Gaun, Lion, Juran, Tyranno, Majin, Dragon, Rune, Dump. Dump, Truck, Tyrannosaurus, Lion, and Dragon. Kikai Henke is what's called when the robots shift from their mecha forms. I'm sorry, switch to their mecha forms because they have the one form and then they're going to have these mecha forms. And you were seeing both of them as I was talking about them. And this is where we were very confused at the beginning because remember, we had seen those scans up earlier and we weren't, we were like, well, we see kind of a suit and then we kind of see a don't suit. And we weren't 100% sure, but now it's definitely looking like there is a, a suit-ish, suit, quote-unquote suit, and then a quote-unquote mecha, but they're the same size, same everything, because they, they it's so predictable. Every Sentai ends on a mecha battle, but they want to change that up a little bit. And that's one thing that I really loved about Go Busters, and maybe you did too, was that it was very different. You didn't always have to have the mecha fight at the end. You could be doing at least both at the same time, and it was a nice change of pace. And I'm excited to see Sentai go into a different direction with trying to find maybe different ways to go about every single one. But uh, there you go. That is when the robots shift to their mecha forms. So then we have Zenkaio Jurageon, Vroomagin, Zenkaio Juramagin, Zenkaio Vroongeon. There are so many combinations that we are all going to be seeing right off the bat with this thing. I These magazine scans cannot come here fast enough because I want to see these guys combine so, so freaking bad. They just look so cool right now, as it is, just seeing them art style-wise. Uh, give me, go, just take my wallet, just take my wallet, and then I'm gonna talk about the Sentai Gears next, because that's all my money. All my money is gone. Would you like to buy a kidney? Or maybe not. It's like 9 o'clock at night. Yeah, I'm, I'm drinking beer. How about we move on to the very last image that we have. This... Oh. It's something. It's something. I. It's one drawing. It's a flat print. I am sure we're going to get better images of it. And then I can, of course, rethink my position on it. Right now, I'm kind of confused. Cause I think, is it like a... Like some weird machine gun thing? And it's got two ends to hold on to it looks a little wackadoodle but i'm sure it's going to be amazing once we get everything done because this is called the gear tlinger
This is actually a gun tie pension device, but developed by Kaito's parents. Now, his parents, of course, I'm thinking are going to be a big part of this because they found parallel worlds. Now they're missing. They developed all of this stuff. These Sentai gears, though, are going to be so freaking collectible. By setting the Sentai gears, and it says they're, quote, condensed versions of super sentai power so if you put the sentai gear into it you can transform into a zenkaiser of that sentai's type robo combo only so that's very interesting and it's also going to allow uh zinkin joran and the rest to grow and combine so this is what they're going to need of course they, they're going to need it to henshin they're going to need it to combine they're going to need it to do everything but these Sentai gears, I'm sure, I mean, once your eyes go, Whoa, after the seeing the um, gear tlinger, you got to go to those Sentai gears, right? You got to start taking a look at these. Again, condensed versions of the Super Sentai. It says they exist across the many parallel worlds. The Sentai gears allow the Zenkaiser to transform. They can also be used to call on those Sentai's powers that I... Kikitopia, one of the many parallel worlds that exists, is a world to the home of the mechanical life swarms known as Kikinoids. The majority of the Kikinoids are beings that are very, very good, but the coolant rulers rules them with a fear and an iron fist, and they are called the quote evil dynasty Tojinto. You know, if your name is Evil Dynasty, you're not gonna be good. Tojinto, Tojit. Tindo, Tojitindo. We're gonna get there. Every time I hear it, every time we see it, we're gonna get a little bit better at all these pronunciations, guys. We are early. This does not start until March 7th. So let's try that all again. Kikitopia Dynasty Tojitendo, the organization who rules over them. And so they're gonna be using the uh Tojiru gears, which is the gears that the villains use, using parallel world text, uh basically misusing all the stuff that Kaito's parents did. They are going to be, worlds are then locked up and then gears are created. Uh, Torjira gears can be set in the minions and call forth the power of those locked up worlds, summoning monsters from them. So this is going to make us think right off the bat, monsters are going to be based off of previous seasons. This is straight up, this is, the mo this is an anniversary season. I am so hyped. I am so excited to see what they can do because it's just different. I've seen how many other regular Super Sentais, and they, they're they all unique, but they all look kind of a lot of alike. And, and to see all of this is just absolute bonkers. And so what I do have to tell you, though, one thing. So we're going to take a look real quick at this suit because Mr. Snowbuddy asked, I freaking love that name, at Ahoy, I'm Harker, really was like, whoa, what if this may be crazy and what you're seeing right here. I think the civilian form boss are partially designed to resemble their color counterpoint from the series. And then you look and you go, oh, by God, I think they're right. I'm probably been out of focus this whole time. That's fine. I think my helmet's been in focus. That's fine. Look at this one. Joran's shorts, Charlotte, Joran's shorts and chest resemble the color breakup scene on Geki's outfit. Oh my gosh. And then you got the lion, and I'm like, okay. You go, okay, man, coincidence? Coincidence? I'm not sure. And then, then you look at for, oh, Gal Ranger. Yellow is Gal Ranger, and it's looking, and you can see in this picture, yellow's got the vest, he's got dog tags on the outside of his shirt. Okay. This is, oh, okay, okay. This is going crazy. And then we get Majin Pink. <gasps> Look at that. Maji Ranger Pink. It's got the skirt with the break in the front. Kind of the belt butterfly-y. This is, this is, this is just crazy. And then you've got Boken Blue looking for uh, Zenkai Vroom. Obviously with the jacket looking. That one's just like, there it is. I can't believe if if this is com not real, then then it's just screw me because this is so freaking cool that that they're doing this with their I don't even know whether civ civilian form bots, but at least that's what Mister Snowbody asked said, and I had to include it because I thought it was the most 
bonk well, not the most bonkers but it was pretty freaking cool and i wanted to make sure that you got a chance to see it and uh and i i, I don't even know where to go from here guys well i mean i know on friday is christmas so and today's tuesday night um just loving zinc heiser i want to know more about his parents the parallel world where all this stuff's coming from what about these these sentai gears I want to see more images of all of these Sentai Gears, of course, up uh, up close. And if you want to even tell you more about, like, oh, what series they were looking at, Reds has 16 on it, same as Zhu Ranger, which I know I said, I think I was trying to say a Sentai with the last uh, Zenkaiser video, and I completely kept butchering uh, the right name of it. But on one side and then on the other side, it has, you know, more numbers, no more images. Although some of them is like, oh, Pat Ranger screwed again because uh, Lupin got 4-2, got 42. And guess who didn't get it? Yeah, yeah, they did jump. But was he? Was he? Was he? Was he? Anywho, guys, I got to just drop it here. This video has already been long enough. I want you, please, 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 if you haven't done already, show, uh, shoot me a subscribe. Hit the bell notification, and as soon as more Zenkaiser news happens, you know I'm going to be covering it. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy Hanukkah to all you guys, Happy Kwanzaa, whatever you're celebrating right now. I hope you have a really great season. Uh, yeah, man, I hope you enjoy it. Let me know in the comments what was your favorite thing of all of this. I think mine's the bird. We'll go with the bird today. And if no one's told you today, I love you and you're awesome. I'll see you in the next video. Mwah! Toodles!